Hi everyone, welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Today's video is a mani I created for Tara's birthday. Happy birthday, Tara. Tara makes her own nail polishes um, call on her little company is called Brave Steva Polish. She also has a Facebook group called Bleacher Creatures. So check her out if you're interested. Check out Bleacher Creatures if you're interested. All the information will be in the description box below. Tara, I hope you like this video. Gailene said you like peacocks. <laughs> so let's just take a look at what I have. And I will show you how I created Tara's birthday mani. Let's get started. <laughs> For this mani, I'm going to use the Wave Gel Base Gel. I'm just going to apply this and cure for 30 seconds. So the uh, base coat is cured. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to remove the tacky layer. Because my fingers are so short, I just want them protected, even though I am using a regular polish, and I am using a Brave Steva polish, and it is called 1995, and unfortunately is no longer available, um, but it was the perfect peacock color, and I was really excited to get it, and I really wanted to use um, this polish for Tara's birthday mani. So let's take a close up and this is a multi chrome and it's purple to green shift. So this should be perfect for peacock colors. So this is one coat and I'm just going to finish up the other nails and then when that's dry we'll come back and we'll do another coat. Okay, now we're going to put a second coat on. And I don't think we're going to need any more than two coats of this. This is so beautiful. Let's see, there we go. Very pretty. So what I'm going to do now is put on Sash Vite Quick Dry Top Coat. And then we wait. Okay, I'm going to use this um, Bundle Monster Bombshell Baby BMXL 359 stamping plate. And I'm going to use these um, peacock feathers right here. And I think this peacock feather right here because Tara likes peacock feathers. <laughs> um, the stamping polish I'm going to use is my Hit the Bottle and it is called Hello They're Beautiful. And this is like a big bottle because it's all that they had left and I really wanted this color. So I bought a big bottle. Um, and I, I just love it. And I think it will go great with this Manny. I didn't want something overpowering and I didn't want anything that was going to blend in too much. So I think this will be perfect. I'm going to use my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper. And oops, I have an Ajuba Scraper sitting around here. So that is what I'm going to use. Okay. 
All right. That picked up really nice, it looks like. Which I'm not sure. I'm going to do it again. I don't know what the heck this line thing is. My stamper all of a sudden. Let's try that again. Oh, it's this plate. Something to do with the scraping of it. Huh. All right, I think we'll be okay because my nails are pretty small. I'm going to put it on this nail right here. Oh, wow. <laughs> that looks completely amazing. Okay. <laughs> Didn't see that one coming. Okay, and for my pinky finger, I'm going to use this little thing, but I'm going to use this. And I realized that my big hand was in the way the last time I used it. So let's see. Yes, I think we're just going to go down like this and you'll be able to see it. Okay. So annoying when you go to edit your videos and find out nobody can see what the heck you just did. Let me tell you. Darn line. I don't know what the heck is with this thing. Um, maybe it's the scraper. Let me get another scraper and try this again. I'm also going to try scraping in a different direction. Now, I never have any issues with this scraper. Oh, look at that. Perfect. All right, and I'm just going to... Well, maybe this wasn't the greatest thing to do. It's so I have to try to figure out how to stick it on there. Oh, there we go. That does not look too bad. Okay, good. All right. So I'm going to clean these up, and then I'm going to do one more thing to this finger, but it is not going to be related to a peacock. So I'm going to clean this up and come right back. Okay, I'm just going to float some top coat oops over my stamping and um i'll be right back i'm going to add some nail gems so i'm going to add a few drops of the shiny no clean top coat to adhere the gems so i'm just going to put a drop on this tin foil And I have got a dotting tool, so I'm just going to add a little gel right where I want my gems. That's it. And then I've got my wax pencil, and I've got these Crystal AB gems. Yeah, I think that looks good. Okay, so I am just going to go ahead and cure that and then I'll come right back. Okay, so here is the finished look. I think those look like peacock feathers. That's what they're supposed to be. <laughs> Anyways, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Tara, I hope you like this video. I like hope you like your birthday Manny that I made for you. And I hope you think these look like peacock feathers. <laughs> um, that's And this polish is just completely amazing. Wow. 
so beautiful. Okay, anyways, thank you all for watching and bye for now.